Well, I got some new fans. They certainly were a lively bunch. Yeah, that's one way to put it. Everyone back home in Alicia is a little more relaxed. You spent your whole life in the village of the Seraphim, right? With no other humans around for miles. Until I met Alicia. I see. Mm -hmm. Alright, I guess we're gonna go see Alicia now. Speaking of her. I thought that her house was actually through that door. Guess I was wrong. I'm slowly but surely getting a feel for the whole layout of the castle area. Or just... I'm in this town. Father Brunor? What the hell is Father Brunor? Alright. Do the star. Ooh, jeez. What is up with this one area that's like making these weird polygons hit my camera? I don't know if I'm walking through the little black we'll specks. Everything we can, but I'm afraid we cannot guarantee a recovery. I'm sorry. It's quite all right. I very much appreciate your diligence. And you? Do you consider yourself prepared? Yes. I shall do everything within my power that I can. Your distinctive personality is a point I greatly admire as your teacher, but I am aware that it also tends to drive the chancellors up the wall. Don't push yourself too hard. I'll let you know if anything happens. Yes. Oh, Saray! Oh, uh, hello there. Should I come back later? Not at all. I was just leaving. Oh, you're... I thank you for your help at the festival, Shepherd Saray. I am Maltran, Knight Preceptor and Advisor to the Royal Army of the Kingdom of Highland. Please do all you can to help Alicia. She could use the support of a good friend. Yes, of course. Hmm. Okay. Wow. I gotta say, she's totally got it together. I know, right? My dream is to be as cool as her. Let's hmm. walk while we chat. Ah, oh, great. More of this weird following thing. You were investigating the ruins, correct? Well, yes, that's true. <laughs> oh my god, she just went through me. <laughs> Hi. Okay, bye. Ah, tea time. This is for you. My knife. Did you find this at the ruins near Alicia? Yeah, I figured it was yours. This is an important item that's been handed down in my family for generations. I thought I'd never see it again. Thank you so much. Let's not tell her we tried to sell it. Um, I do apologize, Whoa. but may we get down to the matter at hand? Lady Lila, forgive me. Wait! Did you just... I could hear her. I definitely heard Lila's voice. Well, this is quite the surprise. Hello? Uh, I see. So it won't be that easy just yet. Lila? I'll explain things, but first, take her hand again. Oh, great. Lila says she'll explain. Can you give me your hand again? Sure. Hello, Alicia? Can you hear me? Yes, yes I can. Loud and clear. I haven't even held my breath yet. <laughs> At this point, you've grown much more accustomed to my power, to the extent that you can now do what you did before without dulling your other senses. I don't feel any different, though. That's good news. It means you don't have to go through all that hassle anymore to make her voice carry. <laughs> it was fun in a way, but good riddance. <clears throat> all right, very well then. Shall we begin? Oh, right. Lila needed to talk with you about something. With me? I would ask that you lend us your power, so
so that we may find the vessels and the lords of the land. May I ask what those might be? To explain fully, I shall need to tell you how this world we live in is structured. In the ancient times, the Seraphim and humans worked together in order to protect their land from the malevolence. The Seraphim and humans worked together? If the vessel they dwelled in was pure of heart and harbored no malevolence, those Seraphim with power would become lords of the land. And through worship by the people, they gained the ability to expand the area of the Blessed Domain, which repels the influence of the malevolence. The sanctuaries were built to honor the lords of the land and keep the area around the sanctuary safe from malevolence. However, the sanctuary in this town has neither a lord of the land nor a vessel, let alone anyone who will properly pray to them. Is that why there's so much bad stuff going down around here? Yes, even if the shepherd purifies the malevolence, it will be impossible to maintain the land's protection without the blessings of the lord of the land. I see. So you wanted to ask Alicia for help in finding a suitable vessel for the Lord of the Land? And should they be found, if those of the Sanctuary would properly worship them both, is that correct? Precisely. Any ideas? As for the Sanctuary, I'm afraid almost all of the pious ones in my country have lost their sense of gratitude towards the Seraphim. No way. However, there is a man named Brunor who has recently ascended to the priesthood. He is a good, sincere man who gave his time to help us prepare for the festival. Would he help? Yes, I believe so. Time is of the essence. I'll head for the sanctuary at once. Well, that was abrupt. But she's not wrong either. We must hurry. Huh. Okay, leaving weird notes for people to find. That's She's gone already. interesting. She's probably heading over to the sanctuary. She's quite the tomboy, that Alicia. Hey, you want to see something cool? Is this your buddy? Is this your buddy? Now he's on fire. Ha 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 Alright, to the church, I believe they said. No more plants? Nope. Man, I'm such a good gardener. Chancellor Bartlow is sending the princess to Marlin, supposedly. So great for the sparrow feathers. Quality goods at reasonable prices. It's a cool mechanic, having like the, the background conversations. It looks like Father Brunor is out around town on an errand. So it goes. Any clue as to the vessel, at least? Let's see. Something free of malevolence. A dog? In the Galahad ruins north of here, there's a pure and clean waterfall. The kings of Highland traditionally bathe in its pristine holy water before their coronation ceremonies. Water of utmost purity. That does sound like something that could be a vessel for a seraph. Is something wrong? Beasts have taken up residence in the ruins of late. Whatever was there was strong enough to kill all ten soldiers who came to drive them out. Hellions? Likely. If we don't hurry, then the waterfall could be corrupted by the malevolence. I take it that's not all, is it? The malevolence is strong in Lady Lake. The holy water will absorb its influence before we have a chance to enshrine and worship it. Water in particular is delicate and easily corrupted by malevolence. No way. Is there anything we can do? Isn't that what Miklio's a seraph of? Is. But in that case, we will need the cooperation of a seraph of water. Ah. As a fire seraph, I'm afraid I am wholly mismatched. A water seraph, huh? Yes. <sighs> by the way, whatever became of Miklio? I haven't heard his voice yet. We... sort of... had a fight. It's a long story. Anyway, to the Galahad Ruins! There's Hellions to smack. That's true. Let's do what we can, first and foremost. Saray, please let me accompany you. I would, but you don't have the power to battle Hellions. But... Saray, 
Just as the Prime Lord can have sublords, so too can there be squires to the shepherd. Uh -huh. If Alicia becomes your squire, she can fight against the Hallians as long as she is within your domain. My squire? But... This sanctuary... No, make that all of the sanctuaries in Highland. They have always been like this from the time I was born. A Highland overrun with malevolence is the only Highland I've ever known. I beg of you, Saray. Please, take me as your squire. So that I may see my homeland free of malevolence. Just like you'd always dreamed of. As you wish, Alicia. <laughs> so then, how does this work? After my incantation, give unto Alicia a true name in the ancient tongue. Huh. Let's see. A true name for Alicia. A new bud forms on the holy branch. Its flowers bring fruit. Its fruit begets seeds. The circle of destiny turns once more. Give life unto the will of the shepherd, and let it be proof of their bond. Thy true name as a squire shall be... Melphis Amechia! What? What does that mean? Happy to be your squire, Saray. Happy to have one, Alicia. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, looks like Miklio's following us. Is he gonna be all jealous? Ooh, have we looked Is at this one yet? Monolith? Uh, HPO, oh, okay, whatever. So is he gonna get all jealous? Is he gonna be like, man, he gets a squire, but I can't become a sublord? Blah, 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 blah. That's just what I'm assuming. He's gonna sound like, blah, 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 blah. Alright, Marlin's come down with the plague. That's not good. Uh, okay, good. All my health's still here. My SC. Huh. So is it gonna be like I can give Seraphs to different people? That'd be pretty cool. Let's go. Exit. I never did check my map. Does it look different? Okay. Alright, which which way are we going? Does this at least tell us something? Entrance to Lady Lake. That way is Great Morgan Falls is I believe where we need to go, so this way I think. That's where we're going, right? Along the river that runs down the forest. Alright, so I did start going the right way. Cool. That is all I needed to know. I finished preparing the gel. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the apple gel. I have like a billion of those. Let's fuck on this snake. Watch out. How does that work? It seems a little bit too. Uh... On Earth? Here it comes, Alicia. Remain calm. Just attack it like you would any other creature. Lord of Fire! Aphidus Hellions are very resilient. Be Release careful. my spirit! Release my spirit! Rhapsody! It's over. Okay. Wait a minute! Burning swords! Predatory flame! Not yet. Vermilion Crescent! These Burning Shelly and everyone! Power. Well done! It's over! Flow forth! Burning, Burning Echo! My will shall pierce thee, just like this spear! Okay. When you're idle, or otherwise not forming combo, you can cast Rejuvenation at the cost of one Blast Gauge. Take about one second to cast, and results in exceptional, exceptional healing, making it useful for emergencies and non-emergencies. 
Oh, okay. I was wondering about that. I was like, why do you, why are you asking me to do this? Soft serve ice cream? Who just leaves ice cream in a chest in the middle of, like, a field right here? Who just... Who's like, mm, nah, I'm just gonna leave my ice cream here. The ancient tongue. We're near one. Changing control mode to manual keys. To attack from the direction you choose, for example, you can use projectile arts to pin an enemy down from a distance. Of course, you can achieve certain effect by even semi mile mode by following quick step with an art. I'm doing pretty good with semi auto. It seems fairly de decent to use. Ah, oh, it's raining. Great. Just what I needed. What the fuck is that? It's an octopus? What kind of creature is this? Be careful Miss of those Mila. legs. They get longer. Release my spirit. Burning shards. Predatory flame. Watch out. I'll strike you down. <laughs> Not yet. I must ah. break through. Burn away. Predatory flame. Such is what I expect of the Seraphim's power. Okay. Uh, performance varies by. Charging, it can be risky, but you can combo off of it. Alright, cool. Uh, 